In today's video, I will teach you how to create a grid in GIMP. Let's get started. Creating a grid in GIMP is useful for various purposes, such as aligning elements or dividing your canvas into equal selections. First, you need to launch GIMP and open the image or create a new canvas where you want to add the grid. Now, let's enable the grid. To do this, go to the menu bar, go to View, and select Show Grid to enable the grid. You should see the grid overlay on your canvas by now. But if needed, you can customize the grid settings by going to the menu bar, Image, then select Configure Grid. In the Grid Configuration dialog box, you can set the grid spacing or the distance in between the grid lines and choose whether you want the grid to be displayed in pixels, inches, or other units. Now, there's an option in GIMP that allows you to automatically snap elements and graphics into the grid which makes it easier to align them accordingly. To do this, go to the menu bar, go to View, then select Snap to Grid to toggle the Snap to Grid feature. Now, if you simply want a grid, you can stop here. But if you want to create a visible grid on your image, then we need to add a new layer. In the Layers panel, click on the New Layer icon at the bottom. Now, choose the Layer Size and Transparency options, then click OK. In the Layers panel, click on the New Layer to activate it and to make sure that we're working on the new layer and not the background layer. To draw the grid lines, Select the Bucket Fill tool from the toolbar, or simply press Shift-B on your keyboard for a quick tool switch. Now, set the foreground color to the color you want for your grid lines. Now, click anywhere on the canvas to fill the new layer with the chosen color. You can also adjust the grid after creating it. You can simply go back to the grid settings to modify the grid spacing or units whenever you want. And if you want to temporarily hide the grid, you can simply toggle its visibility by going to the menu bar, go to View, and select the Show Grid option. And that's it! You've successfully created and customized a grid in GIMP. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.